Hey guys, it's Kerry. I've got some wonderful sea animals today and I'm going to show you my new Helicoprian. It is an extinct genus of shark-like cartilaginous fish. The teeth are arranged in spiral clusters called tooth whorls. They would have been embedded in the lower jaw. The unusual tooth arrangement is thought to have been an adaption for feeding on soft-bodied prey and it may have even functioned as a de-shelling mechanism for hard-bodied cephalopods. Goblin shark? They are spotted mostly off the coast of Japan. They are named for their likeness to mythical goblins. Please subscribe and turn on notifications. Tiger shark? Their teeth are unique with very sharp pronounced serrations and an unmistakable sideways pointing tip. Their teeth have developed to slice through flesh, bone and other tough substances such as turtle shells. Like most sharks, its teeth are continually replaced by rows of new teeth throughout the shark's life. They breed by internal fertilisation. With copulation, the male inserts one of his claspers, which does the same job as a penis, into the female's genital opening, which is called cloaca, acting as a guide for the sperm. The male uses his teeth to hold the female still during the procedure, often causing the female considerable discomfort. This is amazing footage. A black seal is being taken by a shark. Great white shark. It is most frequently found off southern Australia. That's where I live. In Australian waters, the white shark's range is extensive. They are also found in South Africa, Northern California and the Northeastern United States. Despite their scary reputation, sharks rarely ever attack humans and would much rather feed on fish and marine mammals. Sharks are opportunistic feeders, but most sharks primarily feed on smaller fish and invertebrates. Some of the larger shark species prey on seals, sea lions and other marine mammals. The great white shark is one of only a few sharks known to regularly lift its head above the sea surface to gaze at other objects such as prey. This is known as spy hopping. White sharks are curious creatures. By lifting their head, they're probably able to smell things such as prey even better. Their behaviour and social structure are complex. Females dominate males, larger sharks dominate smaller sharks, and residents dominate newcomers. To hunt fur seals, the shark will approach the surface at a high speed, resulting in the momentum taking the shark partially or completely clear of the water. They can reach speeds up to 40 kilometers per hour and can at times launch themselves more than three meters up into the air. Megalodon, they became extinct because the diversity of its prey decreased and new predators appeared as competitors. The new predators were the ancestors of the killer whales and this just happened to coincide with a drop in the diversity of their potential prey. When the range of the megalodon occupied shrank, numerous smaller marine mammal species disappeared as well. The jaw of a megalodon could reach up to 3 metres in width. In the past, climate changes have generally been blamed for its disappearance. Total length was up to an incredible 18 metres. These giant creatures lived between 23 million and 2.6 million years ago. 
In the early Miocene, the sharks were mainly found in the northern hemisphere in the warm waters. Later, they moved further into the Asian, Australian and South American coasts. Bull shark? They are diadromous, meaning they can swim between salt and fresh water with ease. All elasmobranchs have a rectal gland which functions in the excretion of excess salts accumulated as a consequence of living in seawater. Bull sharks living in freshwater environments decrease the salt excretory activity of the rectal gland, thereby conserving sodium and chloride. Reproduction is one of the reasons why adult bull sharks travel into the river. It is thought to be a physiological strategy to improve juvenile survival and a way to increase overall fitness of bull sharks. The young are not born with a high tolerance for high salinity, so they are born in fresh water and stay there until they are able to travel out. Cranosaurus, its big teeth enabled it to crush the shells of the ammonites that lived in the same sea and its sheer size meant that it could have eaten just about anything smaller than it. Pliosaurus, their teeth have a triangular cross section. It cruised along using just the two fore flippers using the back pair for extra speed when pursuing and capturing prey. Zephactinus When alive, the fish would have resembled a gargantuan fanged tarpon. Mesosaurus was around during the last 20 million years of the Cretaceous period. With the extinction of the ichthyosaurs and pliosaurs, mosasaurs became the dominant marine predators. They became extinct at the same time as the dinosaurs at the end of the Cretaceous period, about 66 million years ago. Half a fish is able to secrete lethal toxins or even attacking other threatening animals with its beak-like teeth. The beautiful koi fish, a member of the carp family. Cronosaurus, although slightly shorter than the Mosasaurus, what it lacked in length, it made up in bulk. Kemp's Ridley Hatchling. They reach maturity between 7 and 15 years of age. Anglerfish. They are bony fish, named for their characteristic mode of predation in which a modified luminescent fin acts as a lure for other fish. Coelacanth, they are nocturnal piscivores that feed mainly on benthic smaller fish and various cephalopods. They are passive drift feeders. Angel shark, their unique features are the rounded tip of the nose, the seven gills instead of five and only one dorsal fin. Anomalocaris, they are extinct. 
they are distantly related to modern day arthropods including crabs and lobsters. Cuperocerus was a genus of nautiloid cephalopod from the Permian period that resembled a spiny ammonite. Cretoxebrina was one of the largest sharks and a formidable predator in the late Cretaceous seas. Crocodile, they eat mainly fish, turtles, birds and other small animals. They capture water animals in their jaws with a sideways motion. They seize land animals by the feet and drag them towards the water. After crocodiles mate, the female lays eggs. Some types can lay up to more than 100 eggs. Green sea turtle, they are one of the world's largest species of turtle, weighing between 65 and 130 kilograms. Hermit crab, hatchlings are born in the water and remain there for a time. They molt up to six times to reach full crab form. Humpback calf. Ichthyosaurus. They use their fins for swimming. They lived in the sea and were incapable of returning to land. Their tails had a large crescent shaped fin Leatherback turtle. The leatherback shell is leathery. It feels almost rubbery. Lyopleuridon was a large species of pliosaur. It was an apex predator in the upper Jurassic seas around 160 to 155 million years ago. It grew to about six and a half meters and it was a relative of Biosaurus and Chronosaurus. Lobster, they have two big claws and eight walking legs. Megalardon ruled the seas from about 17 million years ago up to almost 3 million years ago. This colossal predator reached lengths of up to 20 metres. The only marine animal ever to outweigh the massive megalodon is the blue whale, which weighs up to 200 tonnes, which would be just more than double the size of megalodon. Its jaws could open wide enough to swallow two adults standing side by side. Giant squid, along with their cousin the colossal squid, they have beach ball sized eyes. Their eyes are the largest eyes in the animal kingdom and are about 10 inches or 25 centimeters in diameter. Their big eyes help them to spy objects in the dark depths where most of them live. Blue ringed octopus. They are usually nocturnal, emerging at night to hunt crustaceans and small fish. The brightly coloured rings are a warning to would-be predators. Blue sea dragon swallows air bubbles that allow it to float on the ocean surface upside down. So the interesting blue and white colour is actually the bottom side of the blue dragon. Seahorse, they come in many colours varying from grey, orange, brown, yellow, red and black. Shrimp, they will eat algae, dead and living plants, worms, fish, snails and other dead shrimp. Cuttlefish, 
cool as Sucus. Basilosaurus. Basilisk. Octopus baby. Sea star. Cronosaurus. Mosasaurus. Axolotl. Emperor penguin and chick. Horseshoe crab. Nautilus. Nautilus. Ammonite pleurocerus. Ammonite previtocerus. Orthocerus Bellumnite Trilobite Zephactinus Helicoprion Sea Elephant Manatee Largemouth bass, salmon, piranha, sailfish, red eared slider turtle, goblin sharks. Narwhal Weedy Sea Dragon Please stay and watch another video with me I love to read and reply to all of your comments Thank you for watching my video See you again soon